From the dawn of time we came, moving silently down through the centuries, living many secret lives, struggling to reach the time of the gathering, when the few who remain will battle to the last. No one has ever known we were among you, until now. something to say. It's better to burn out than to fade away. <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name is Trax and today we are continuing our playthrough as the Kurgan. And we, at the end of the last episode, we had recently conquered Jao Marys and Legeta. Um, now Legeta was taken back and you know, a bit of trading, but we it's now back in control of Valandia, who's the faction I'm with. Um, and overall, we're looking pretty damn strong. And I would like to participate in this tournament, but I only have 6% health after the last siege. So I'm just going to let this one pass me by. We could get engaged instantly, which would not be ideal as I'm quite weak. Um, and what I'm actually hoping for is to just regain my health and actually hit this next experience level, which would be amazing. Now, in the last episode, I got paid. I was going to leave the army um, with all my gear because I've reached the highest tier. But I was offered 25 grand to stay on. Um, oh, 54%. Let's do it. Let's do it. All right. Let's see what this is like. I think this is going to be an Empire tournament. I'm not sure if it changes. Um, meh. Not great. Oh, God. All right. Got one. We got one. All right. I'm a bit worried about this. Keep the old circling. He has a shield. It's obviously a big advantage. And he is down. Let's take that shield for ourselves. Switch back to the bow. And try and take this bowman out over there. Because he's going to cause us problems later on. Uh, Arco's still up, but we need to stop him. Hey, Sturther! Sturther calls him problems, as per usual. Uh, an epic duel going on between these two, and I'll ruin it with a bow attack. If I could ever hit anyone or anything. Ooh. And we cost Sturther the round. Well done, hardened crossbowman. Let's continue to bet on ourselves. Alright, it's a three, three for all. Uh, everyone's kind of going a bit weird. Oh, what the... Old Edoran, my old nemesis, has taken me out. My one-handed skills are not very good. And I think I can... I mean, there's no way I can qualify, I don't think. Someday I will kill Edoran. I hate that guy. It's quite an epic duel between these two. But 
the Kurgan is over there just chilling out on the ground. And Edoran wins. And I've been disqualified. I shall leave in a massive huff. Um, but, you know, that's the way it is. I have 78,000, which is insane. And I think one more battle will see me go with 14,000 experience. I'm not quite sure what happens if I do another level up now. I'm not sure what that will give me, but I'm quite interested to see. We're going to take Ataconia Castle. Christ, we're trying to split the Empire right down the middle. This seems a bit of a weird one to go for. I would... There's one up here. Gao something. But, alright. We're here. We're besieging Atakonia. 222. That's not that too bad. Let's lure these raiders, these looters in. And get a bit of real combat. Okay. Plan is to get them to range and shower them with arrows, okay? There's 22 of them. They're... Poorly armed with little to no armor. But we better get them into range and. Oh, ho, ho, ho. That is a horrific outcome for that dude. And that dude. I'm starting to see a pattern emerge. Oh, we managed to use the sickle effectively there. Sturgy getting in on the action. And another is down. Now the cavalry have just laying waste to these dudes now. I credit them for not running. They just broke over the top of the hill to hundreds of men. Absolutely devastating them. I can't see where the last dude is. Everyone's going this direction. Did one of them not come with? Where the hell is this guy? There must be... They must have, have split their forces somehow here. Edge of the map? Alright. Wherever they were, they're gone now. And that is it. A good way to start some, the uh, process of killing off. And a little bit of experience bump for me. Now, I am hoping to level up and be able to leave the army. As I have a lot of gold to spend and a lot of ideas to implement. And right now I cannot really do that while I'm following these armies around. Um, I'd also like to build up a little retinue and just then rejoin the army with these people in tow because then their wages are paid for as well. What the hell was this all about? All right, I'm going back to defend Jalmaris, which should be interesting because if they're besieging Jalmeris, there should be a sizable force to deal with, which will mean a sizable battle. Now they're, they're kind of following us around a bit. Right. I find it weird we're not going straight for them, but six... Ooh, let's go, let's go, people. Why? Wow. Durthurt has abandoned the calls, and we're actually could get into a bit of trouble here. 
a lot of men. Like, small armies that could take us out. See, there, there, you, you should not have uh, abandoned that there. I think Jalmeri's may fall now. We'll have to see. Wow, we're going to kill some peasants, is this? Is this accurate? I feel kind of bad about this, but okay. I'm not sure we're going to be able to catch them. Peasants are known to run very quickly. Alright, we sh No, they just got away. But we are leaving ourselves somewhat open to... Um, being attacked. This is utterly bizarre. And we're losing all our men for some weird reason. What is going on? Do we have no food or something? I have no idea what just happened. Durfurt lost all his men and I'm the only guy left. Now I have to defeat 11 mountain bandits by myself in order to not be annihilated. Suffice to say, my confidence in Durfurt is lowered greatly. I think the best thing to do is to take out the mounted troops first. Because they could harass me to the end of time. Whereas the others, I can actually escape from a bit. Alright, this guy's low on health. And now he's dead, so he's got no health. Right, playing strategically here is going to be key. Don't think they have a huge amount of range. Let's just assess this. Right, they're throwing rocks at me, so they can't do. Let's try and soften them up. Kill would be lovely, guys. If you could just die for me, that'd be great. And then I think the time to abandon Durther is nigh. I'm not saying I'm abandoning Valandia yet, but this debacle is uh, not reflected well on him. Shields and spears, which are, as we know from this playthrough, are the bane of any mounted troop. This guy is tough. Try for, trying for headshots, but I just don't have the accuracy to pull these off. Alright, we got one. We got one with their shields. So we're going to have to try to break these shields now. But this is the problem. Charging guys with spears are, is a nightmare. But luckily, we do have a lance. And although I'm not very skilled with it, we can use this to our advantage. I don't see a way to get close to these spearmen otherwise. Ooh, I'm so close to getting dropped here. Ooh. 
All right, my mount received damage there, but not me. Ooh. I'm trying to play it real cagey. I don't know how I can actually win this without taking one more piece of damage. Ah, oh, and I hit, got hit. And that is it. Yes! Durther, you have let us down, for sure. And you've resulted in me being captured by mountain bandits. And I lost five grand. And we're free, in a sense. It's not the way I wanted to be freed. But I am free nonetheless. Did I lose any equipment during that? It doesn't look like it. No, I am good. But I didn't get to leave the army with my bloody equipment, which I normally would have done. Anyways. We'll just avoid combat, and we're going to get back to Sargot, the land of the free Valandians. Beautiful. My relations increased with someone for some reason. I think it's a perk I have. Okay. Recruit troops, no. Tavern district, yes. All right. I'm going to talk to Randana the Wronged. Tell me about yourself. You got spirit. All right, let's hire. Talk to this bloke. He's injured as well. What the hell is going on? I accidentally didn't recruit him there. Now I'm visiting the tavern. Alright, we'll take him for 2k. And there should be another dude in here somewhere. Am I awake? Ooh, the Kurgan wants a fight. Alright, I just hit her with a body shot. Game host. Victor, blah, blah, blah. All right, noble of you, sir. All right, 1,500. All right, so we, we've got three people in my party. And the reason I'm doing that is I can get someone to foot the bill for them. Trade. Let's have a little upgrade of some of the hoe. Okay. I'm just selling off all this crap. And 445, or 55 rather. What do we have? A storm charger. Better charge damage. Better speed, but way less hit points. Hmm. I'm unsure. Sturgy's maneuver as well. I'm going to stick with Sturgy. What I am looking for is a two-handed sword that has better length than what I'm currently using. 97. 105. That's still one-handed. Fuck. Okay. A short bill. All right. This... Incredible length. All right, I'll try the short bill. The length and damage is encouraging. What else can we partake in? I mean, maybe just buy a better set of arrows. Lowland arrows, two pierce. 
Botkin arrows, three pierce. Uh, stacked Botkin arrows. Right, I'll take the Botkin arrows. We'll get rid of arrows. Upgrade, upgrade. I'll keep my bearded axe for now, just in case. I don't like this bill. I've only wasted 12,000 on it. Um, armor. What can we buy here in terms of armor? We do have a decent helm. Um, so I won't worry too much about 110,000 gold helm. Um, this can be upgraded quite easily. And I'll go for the banded leather. Sell that off. And uh, mm -mm. male mittens, male chuls chulses. And all right, so I'm paying 23 grand out. Where is old Dirthy? Last seen at Galend today. There is a tournament. Oh, I'm only at 34% health. All right. Let's go meet up with Durther and find out what happened. That was a bloody disgrace. Let's be real. Party. These guys are all beat up to... F all right. They are back, though. A bit of trade. Du -du -du. We're just looking for a better horse, basically. Not the Sturgy is not the best horse in the world, but, you know. Maybe he'd occasionally like a rest. Alright, we will take... We'll talk to you. Yeah, tell me about yourself. Alright, we'll take him. Talk. Alright. I have as many companions as I can manage now. The Galend. Where I will meet with our man. Alright, he's no longer in. That's in Galend today. Alright, that's clearly not true. Um, trade. Do they have any better horses they do not war razor a knightly arming sword all right I'll, I'll stick with the bill that i have now um and you know what i actually will pick up something to throw because I want to get better at throwing. It's three in a stack, five in a stack. I'll take the hook javelins. All right, I'm ready. Let me at them. I need to find old Durther. First of all, let's see how my new crew do. You'll never take us alive. Okie doke. We want to check this bill out. A little slow, a little slow. Mm. Alright, only Sturgy hit there. Ooh, they got a dodge off. Again, only Sturgy got a hit. So far, this is proving oh, 324 damage, okay. Hmm. So, although it's slower, it is hit and kill, it seems. And it is harder to time the hit.
And the range is good though, the range is good, but 349, that is insane. I'm yet to hit for less than 300. Verona's scholars down. Come on, guys, fight. That's a two for one. All right, attack them, guys. Fucking up. <laughs> I lost two of them. Did they die? No, they're all right. All right, moving swiftly onward. We're going to head back to Jacqueline. Jacqueline. I'm making friends with people all over. Uh, arena. Da, da, da. All right, let's keep on rolling. And to Sargot we go. I do believe I gained a level that I didn't see there. Alrighty, let's have a look. So I can boost my own morale with kills. Or I can break my enemies. Obviously, I'm going to go with the Terror. <laughs> I am the Kurgan, let's be real. Uh, that is what we do. Um, I think a point in polearm and a point in athletics is what we'll do with that. I just had a thought. This is an axe. I just <laughs> worried it was a polearm suddenly. And that's why it was a bit harder to handle. All right, we have their third. He's at Varchek. All right, beautiful. What's he doing in Varcheg? I don't know. You know, I'm going to buy this horse. Just to see what it's like. Sturgi's still my main man. But I want to see what this speed feels like. And if... Uh, the maneuverability is going to have an effect. And we're going to go link back up with Durthurt. And I think we can take most gangs who come, we come across. I'm not going to bother equipping my companions yet. I can't be bothered. My gold has taken quite a hit. But that is okay. Luckily, we know a way to make a lot of gold. Twenty-two days until no food. All right, there's a war going on with the Celts and the Empire. Is it? Yeah, looks like it. All right, this is ruled by Thurthert, who is somewhere in the vicinity. I don't really want to pay. Money to go see him. But I will just do a bit of a loopy till the morning and see if I can get in the key. There's no. Alright, whatever. 600 to talk to my mate Durther. Alrighty, I need Durthurt to go outside with his bloody army then. Otherwise I can't sign up as a soldier with him. Which I do want to do. Seems as though the war with the Empire has ended though. And you know what? I am considering going my own way. As I don't want to wait around for old Dirty to come out of the 
bloody castle. So let's have a chin wag. Uh. Alright, so he won't take me because, yes, I am not sufficiently renowned yet. So we will just go and look for someone to sign up with ourselves. That will take our sword. Funhard, you seem like a nice fellow. Does he like me? He doesn't like me. All right, I'm tier five, which is beautiful. And I will switch to champion, uh, but let's make sure I enhance my stats a little bit. Um, we got Storm Charger. Um, where is Sturgy? Did I lose Sturgy? Oh no. Sturgy. I'm really cut up about this. Did I sell him by accident? All my stuff is gone. I lost a lot of my equipment when I did that. I'm almost certain I kept Sturgy. This is upsetting. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna do my best to win this for Sturgy. Fuck you. This horse sucks. This is greatly upsetting me. Sorry, Footman is down. I mean, this explains why the Kurgan became who he is. Fucking hell, where do all my blokes go? Alright, they're all gone. This is why he became bitter. Okay. Time to focus. I have an axe and a shield. And I'm against a trained infantryman. How did I fall down there? What the hell? Alright, we took him out. We took him out. Sorry, I'm a little uh, uh, still emotional about old Sturgy dying. Not dying, but disappearing. I mean, it's Fer oh no, I'm with Fernhard versus Durther, who I kind of blame for this whole situation, so. Our guy took two arrows there, which is not good. What is going on with this falling over? I'm not entirely sure, but... Alright. 
I guess Dirt Dirt is skilled in the art of combat. Alright, this is not ideal. One handed is my weakest discipline uh, with the Kurgan. We took out old Fernhart, our new liege, for a victory. But a bittersweet one. Maybe Sturgy will be in my personal. Because right now I don't have uh, quite a few of my um, piece of equipment. So maybe I'm overreacting. We shall see. Now, I'm not tier 6, so I think I lost all my retinue. retinue. Which would be very unfortunate. And honestly, it's, it's made me a little embittered, the whole thing. We do have a new war with the Northern Imperium, it looks like. And Fernhard is decided to flee the opposite direction. Fantastic. Well done, mate. I actually want to lure the bandits. I want to see how fast this new horse is. Let's do this. Oh, that damage is extreme. Beautiful backdrop in which to... I got hit though and off balance with that strike. Oh, double kills. Okay, the damage potential of this weapon is insane. It's just... I mean, those double kills are coming frequently. The downside, however, is it's a bit harder to land the hits than my old shovel axe. But, you know, I can't be mad at that performance. Horse is quick as well, but a bit lacking the old manoeuvring. All right, why don't we join up with Cervic there? Oh, do it. All right, now we've decided to retreat all the way back. Fantastic. I'll just leave this one to the others because I was actually after the 45 unit one, which I missed again. Okie doke. Let's just kill these guys personally. That's good damage. That is good damage. I mean... It's a hit, a kill, basically. I need to try it out in battle, though. Like a big scale battle. But right now, it seems good. 
it's just going to be a little bit more uh, getting used to the handling, timing the swings, not as quick as the axe. Alright, I am looking reasonably in a good position here. Engaging two looters, right, let's just let you guys... Alright, we did that, well done. No tournament here in which to partake. And maybe Fernhard will actually decide to partake in the war. All right, I have leveled up, it looks like. All right, Praven just got a major upgrade. And we're going to defend Kranjok. Kranjok, whatever it's called. I mean, that looks good to me. 930 men, no? All right. Fernhard is a very uh, single-minded man. Oh, let's lure, lure. No, 52 men, come on. We're at war with these guys, apparently, the Brotherhood. We're being pursued by 80 looters. Seemingly forever. I really did a number on them, luring them. Okay. The moment before the charge. We're gonna go straight through these lane fucks. That was upsetting. There was no hit. That was a double hit and a double kill. A double hit, but no double kill that time. He ain't getting up. Neither is he. His leg is gone. Oh, this thing is is beautiful to hit with. I must admit. For fun, this is hard to match. I will say. Run, buddy! You're the last one! Ah, you're dead. Alright. That was somewhat enjoyable. I, I will leave that to the others. Brave man stood by himself against 136 men. Okay, what are we doing here, Fernhard? Yeah, I'm beginning to lose patience with you. Sadly. All right, we've been ambushed by 94 men. Well, wow. all right, sizable, and a decent cavalry component too. Ain't me goddamn way. Thank you. They're all cavalry. This is what I'm talking about. Alright, laying waste to them. 
Seems like I'm a fucking moving mountain of... Armor as well. Bloody cavalry getting my oh, infantry getting in the way. Pruning my beautiful kills. But so far so good. Fucking hell. Four hundred and fifty-eight. I don't think I've ever hit anyone that hard. All right, I see him. All right, kill him. I mean, why they ambushed us? Not entirely sure. I need forty-eight on that one. Disappointing. Ooh, that is definitely better than forty-eight. I see him, I see him. Oh. It's times like that when you need the slightly faster. Alright, I'm lining him up. And we got him. Almost got his horse too. This guy's coming for me. Ooh, he deflected. Well done, sir. Well done. The master of combat. This guy does not turn as well as Sturgy did. God damn. 92 damage to a bloody horse. That's not what I wanted. And there can be a man. Turning arc is real and all right. Nice deflection by this man. You know what? I'm gonna switch it up. Jesus Christ! My accuracy is horrific. Not that time, though. We got it. I think that is it. I won't bother chasing the stragglers. 12 kills. That's good. Not quite sure what is left here. 19 of the sleeps of the others. Because let's be real, that's not worth going for. All right, well, that's no good now. They all left me, mate. Pretty sure, yes, they're all bloody gone. Very upset about this. Sturgy does appear to be gone. And let's see what we're going to do now. We're going to defend Gersio Castle. I mean, honestly, we're asking to be absolutely wiped out. 132 men. And towards a raid. Okay. So we should, would smash this raid, but we're not engaging for some reason. What the f... Why are we running from 69? What is wrong with us? Go f If you didn't run from 900 men, but you ran from 6... Okay, we are just gonna be corralled into between two armies. And we should be absolutely crushed here. 
they're not going for us, so we got away with it. But this guy is a goddamn coward. Let's fight 84 men. Come on. Alright, this is not what we want, but... We outnumber them by quite a margin. Are they? I sight them. Don't really want to charge our infantry straight up. They don't seem to have cavalry. Driving. I mean, the horse did most of the damage there. Stormy, we'll call him. Oh god, I'm getting hit hard. Alright, I've got two kills. I'm gonna have to be very careful with the rest of my kills though. I don't want to stay on my horse. I mean, if I keep doing stuff like that, I'll be fine. for another strike into a tree. This is a very advanced tactic. See? Works a beaut. They think the tree's taken you out. And stop targeting you. I can hear a few arrows whizzing by me, so... I am down. But, to be honest, I was playing very aggressive there. As the battle is very going to be very one-sided. All right. Now we're following Dirkert, the man who caused all the problems. Um. By allowing his army to completely disintegrate before him. I'm not sure I can forgive him, but... Oh, I can get these guys to join me. Alright, so I do actually have a party now, which is covered with these dudes. Alright, that wasn't a total waste of time. Didn't realise that's what I had to do. Just hit manage retinue. Okie doke. So, it seems we're going to join another big army. Uh, Dirthert's going to gather his army all the way back here, which seems... Somewhat stupid. And we have rebels in Varchek. Durther has a very sizable army, though. And about to get even bigger. So, this is interesting. Very interesting. What is my 18,000 with Valandia? Okay. We have rebels. They are Batanian. Is that right? Maybe I just clicked on the wrong town there. Varcheg. Varcheg's rebels. Alright. Run by Volg. Good name. Ah, here they are. They're joining me. Ah, uh, that's how it works. Okay. I will equip them 
No, I think oh, they can just equip themselves. We'll wait till we run our own unit, which should be soon. Um, we do have an attribute point to assign, however, um, and I am going to go with intelligence. A lesser known thing that uh, we have here. The Kurgan is a well-known polygon. Genius in general. Alright, so it looks like we're gonna just straight up the siege fire check back. And the war with the Northern Imperium is just gonna take a bit of a back seat. Interesting setup here. There's Volg himself. Not really going to take us out with 136 men, Volg. You should just wait a few moments. And Durfler will starve us all to death. We actually do have very low food. Which would be extremely interesting if we uh, suffer the same fate as before. Here we go, taking back Varchek. All right, and I'll just ready up, and I'll dismount from Stormy. And try these new Bodkin arrows, I guess. Avoiding catapults is uh, my main aim. Sight one. Hey! Actually managed to hit somebody. And again, wow. Did I get a kill? I see him. Get nice and close. I see another up there. Their defenses are far less than when we last year, so. And the guys are actually just advancing straight up here. Taking our severe fire, I'm just gonna get up nice and close here. Try and prevent this occurring. Ooh, got it. Fired an hour off willy nilly. Is that a guy's head? No, it wasn't. Oh, and another kill. Archer extraordinaire, the Kurgan. Wow, what's going on? I'm the best archer in the bloody army. But if you live long enough, you will learn everything. All right, we've got a man up there. I don't think I get the angle on him there. Actually, strategically stood back. And I'm out of hours, didn't even realize. I guess that means it's time to just get in amongst it. Alright, I've got my ridiculous the oversized axe. Oh god, this is a tough one. Just trying to 
dispense death as best I can without... Oh my god, I am killing a lot of men here. Alright, strategic drop off the battlements. Repositioning. Behind. Let's just give him a kill. Let's go for this guy. Oh, crap. Alright, we got him. Oh. The Kurgan is down. 12 kills. Alright, we will take this. No problem. They're taking a lot of losses. Considering the level of the fort. Now, enough men have flooded up that this, this was taken with just bloody ladders, for God's sake. Right, and that should be it. They are being completely routed now. And that is that. Varchek is back in our hands. The Kurgan... Got a bit of renown there. But the big question is what I shall do now. We leveled our bow. Where? All right, we'll take merry men. Not quite sure why, but. And. I think that is probably a quality place to... That's a good place to end today's episode. Uh, thank you for tuning in, guys. And I'll catch you on the next one. If you're enjoying them, remember to like and subscribe. Bye-bye now.